Right, this would be a pain to work around, so I'm just gonna give me those things and a steering stick, please. And give me my special contraption. So where are we going off to the this? We gotta see Colton at some point. I do need to go see Colton. But I don't have enough gems for him. That's why I'm also go the bubble frogs in the caves also are going to be helpful and useful to us. Because um it's a few more until we get that hat. I'm pretty sure it was a bunch of Gleeock horns or something right now, so we need many more things. You need six now? I think it might be five. Five or six? I'm not entirely sure. I don't really remember. Are you an electric lizard? You're just a bit of grass. Is this the cave? That's the cave. I remember you because I needed to find a Korok inside at some point. Don't hit the walls. Don't hit the walls. Thread the needle. Thread the needle. Well, oh, it's a skeleton. Right, I remember coming in here. It's because it was a skeleton. Was there anything else actually down here? I just remember coming in here because of a, a, a Korok. Nothing else, though. There's just a bunch of stuff. We don't even care about this stuff. Um, oh, there is the bubble frog. That's what we needed. Can I, um, give, give me the ride. Don't hit the bones. Don't hit the ribs. I will shoot you mid-air. There it goes. Six. All right, so that's this cave, that's that cave. I don't think there's anything else for us in this cave. It doesn't look like there's anything else in this cave. It's just really big and empty. If there's other stuff for us in this cave, I'm sure we'll find out in the future eventually. Why is there like a rib cage buried in this? I don't, uh, so many questions. I'm curious enough about that spine to pull up the fan, but not, not, not for anything else. Blow all of the sand away. This is the Skyward Sword portion of the stream where we blow sand away with a giant jar, but it's not a jar. Can we fuse this to, like, a weapon or something? Because it, I can manipulate this. What can I use this thing for? What is, what is this thing? I can't fuse this to anything. Well, why could I manipulate it? Oh, it's probably because I need to put this on the tail and like, I'll get like a Korok or something. All right, so I'm, I'm curious enough to put this back where it's supposed to be. Where is the tail? Or where is this supposed to go? It's, it, I can guarantee that this is supposed to fit on something. Where does it fit on? Where, I, I, it's too small to be a rib. Hmm, I can't fuse this with anything, which means this is a puzzle. Maybe by, this is probably like the horn, perhaps? It looks like a, it looks like a, a Bokoblin horn, so it's probably a horn. Or like maybe a row of teeth, perhaps? Hmm. Or I could just be overthinking this and nothing about this is in any way, shape, or form required. But I feel like, I feel like a, a manipulatable bone like this, buried in sand with a fan nearby, should have some kind of puzzle attached to it. Maybe we bring it up to the top. I feel like I am going about, I feel like I'm doing something that doesn't need to be done. But that's also like 90% of my life. Maybe it's just like a spine. I'll put it on the head. Wait, there's breakable rocks up above? All right, can I put this on the head? Okay, stay there. And I hope that doesn't... Okay. Oh, there's a rib cage. Okay, well, now we have a rib cage. Why did I bother with a rib cage? What else is up here? I need, it doesn't matter, no matter what. 
Okay, now I need to solve this mystery because they just gave us a rib cage and like a spine. So do we have to like rebuild our own stall knocks? Because like there there is no other solution to this puzzle. Okay, so let's bring that back down. Okay, so what is this? Because that thing has like hands, right? This thing reminds me of Stall Lord from uh, Twilight Princess. Okay, there is a puzzle in here, and I am doing it. No one even acknowledged the fact that I'm doing this. Just be dead silent about it. Like, do not even attempt to give me hints. I will I will log into Twitch and undo Llama Lord's ban of me, just so I can ban you if you even mention it. So we need more stuff, right? Because this, this is like a thing. Like, that's a hand. That's like a crawly dude. That's a lizard. And that's a lizard tail. So we need to find more things. We need to find more things. Where, if I were a thing, where could I go? Probably up by the jaw, perhaps. I would more than understand if people left the stream at this point, because this is just the most engaging content, I do realize. I don't understand how anyone could not find this to be as interesting as the most heated of television so shows. There's got to be some, in the eyes, perhaps? No. In, this is like, this is nothing but a hole in the skull. It can't be outside, because there's nothing outside. Why would they give me this, then? Why would they give me this if there's nothing here? There can't, there can't just be nothing. Okay, so I want to say something. Go for it. Go for it. This is part of a side quest. Oh, it's a side quest. If there's a side quest, then there's probably nothing here until the side quest starts. Oh, I probably, if it's a side quest, I probably have to reconstruct the skeleton and like take a picture of it or bring a dude here. All right, if there, if it's a side quest, it says something about the head, but not where the head is at. Right, okay, so if it's a side quest, we can come back and do it later. So I think maybe you start with the head, which means we probably need to come back here and then it'll spawn the head for the side quest. Okay, 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 that's, well, if that's the case, to Grudo Town and let's get this side quest going because I'm so curious. I appreciate you letting me know because I genuinely would have spent the next hour doing nothing. So, I'm glad that that works out, but now I'm curious to figure this out, because I don't just spend 40 minutes doing the same thing and not get something out of it, so... We better, we better get something out of this. I meant to press the other button. Okay, now we just need to find whoever has the side quest. They've got to be in here, right? There's so many side quests in here that we haven't done. Oh, precious statue in the water. Please give me heart. Heart container, please. You know what? Not yet. I only have six. I want to wait until I get more. Is there a side quest in here? Oh, I guess we're going to school. To learn how to please Apollo better. So this is when you usually have the class for the younger students. You might not know this. Oh, I need to get a picture of Madison while we're here. You might not know this, but it's something of a rule in Grudo Town that Young Vi don't speak to Vo. Since this class is for Young Vi, I can't let you come in. Oh, you're talking to me. You're more than welcome to come to the class in the evening. It's just this one that's off limits. The guards will have to, the guards will have to lock you up if you get caught breaking our laws, and no one wants that, right? Oh. Say no more, ma'am. I will not intrude upon your young traditions. Uh, I don't care about those. That's not the thing that I need. Those seem breakable. Hopefully, detonating bombs in the Grudo shelter does not hurt. Well, you know, it hurts, but, like, not the structural integrity. What does this say? What is the point of this? Why? Why? I... I... Weird. Is there anything in here that I can use? This doesn't help. All right, so there might not be a quest in here for us. Oh, fine. I might as well get it. What do you need? Do you have glasses? Oh my god, the Grudo can wear glasses. That's incredible. Sava. 
Oh, you must be the vote that everyone's talking about. Say, are Hylian and Voe interested in archaeology? <laughs> I just watched an Indiana Jones movie, my friend. I am, I am in the mindset for archaeology. Would it surprise you to learn that I'm an archaeologist myself? Dr. Rotana. After much work, I have finally deciphered this steely. Ah. Do you want to know what's written on them? You do, don't you? I absolutely do. If you insist. What do they say? <laughs> First up, the Stella over here on the left. It says, The seven heroines who protect the Grudo, their secret will be expressed on on six Stella. Steelies. <laughs> plaques. As for the Stella over there, on the right, it says, the seven heroines who protect the Grudo in eighth channels and guides the powers of these seven. Ah. I doubt you know this, being a highly involved, but we Grudo have believed in the heroines for a long, long time. Hmm. They are said to have protected and guided our people in times past. Unfortunately, I have found little in the way of, of excuse me, of documentation about these heroines themselves. Hmm. There are many debates and disagreements surrounding these enigmatic figures. Some argue for revering all seven as a collective, and others for worshipping each one as an individual. Certain rabble-rousing contrarians even claim there are not seven, but one, or eight. If there is one thing scholars love, it's arguing with each other. Tell me about it. But these Stella definitely support the theory of eight. An incredible discovery, isn't it? I could stop here and rightly say that I changed the face of archaeology. But if I found the other four Stella, who knows what else I might learn about the heroines. I wonder too about this orb that I found while searching for the Stella. Is it connected somehow? <laughs> if I gave a presentation on all this, I'd be star of the archaeology society. Mm. But I have not been able to find any Stella besides these two. Well, I literally just uncovered a third. It's just like down the hallway to the left. Since there's nothing like them on the surface, there must be other underground somewhere. How oh, I wish I could see the text. Oh, just a picture. Sure. Well, if we're putzing around Grudo Town, I'm sure we can find more pictures. Monument to Seven Heroines. Take a picture for later. So we need to get six more. Or four more. What did that say? Four Stella. So one. So there's three more out and about the town. I'm sure we can track down more of them. Oh, Kelly Ban. Woman after my own heart. Aww. What do you want? I'm busy right now. I need to make sure my vote of my dreams. Aww. Get out of here. Scram. What about down here? We've never actually explored anything around here. Aw. Dude, did you get caught in jail? Can I talk to you? Let me talk. Let me talk. Please. I must speak to the dude. You have, you have no idea how important it is. I get this dude's story. I... I, okay, okay, this is important to me. I'm going to make this work. Link, link, the ceiling. The ceiling, Link. Okay, okay, okay. No, oh, so close. Can I, can I, wait. Can I, can I move? Oh, oh, oh. Put it on its side. That way I get the extra height. I need to talk to him. Link, you need to stand up on the box. Yes. Hey, wait, you're a guy, aren't you? How come you're able to just walk around? Why haven't they arrested you? It's no secret that the Grudo rigidly enforced their law that forbid men from entering the town. So how come you're able to just walk around without causing a fuss? I mean, I barely crossed a threshold between town and desert, and they threw me in jail faster than I can say, No, wait, not jail. They didn't give me a chance to explain anything at all. I just wanted to see the faces of my wife, Perda, and her daughter, Acolette. But, and I'm only telling you this because you seem like a trustworthy sort, I've actually seen my daughter a few times, so on average, I'm more happy than upset. Oh. Even though they have me in this jail, I do see her occasionally. However, I haven't seen my wife even once. I know she was planning to work at the clothing store in Grudo Town, but that's all I got. I'm sure my daughter could tell me more, but I haven't been able to talk to her yet. Perda, Acolette, I know we'll be together again soon. So what's the story with the dude? Oh. This is the jail. Even though you have special permission to be in Grudo Town, I won't let you pass this point. Really, the only way to, the only way to break, to, the only way into jail is to break our rules. Vo are normally not allowed inside our town. The one in jail broke their rules, so he's locked up. And even though you have permission to be here, if you break the rules, you'll join him in jail. Everyone's gone back into town, but I'm stuck here on guard duty. Doherty? I'm stuck here on the guard duties, keeping watch of the Vos. Oh, stupid Vo! I mean, you could just kill him. 
that would get rid of all of the problem. Oh my god, a bar. Finally. No, let me in. I am 150 years old. Please let me in the bar. I need to be in the... Please, I have frog outfit. Let me in the bar. Let me in the bar. Let me in the bar. My priorities have never been more straight. I need the bar. The bar, please. Sneak under. Sneak under. Ah. Uh... Fine, fine, fine. I need to I need to make more food. Can I break this pot? Uh, that looks like a pot I could break. Oh, those are pots I could break. Oh, I can sneak into the jail. There's nothing in here for us. Can I? What's the point? Break the pots? Money? Well, the money is neat and all, but like, can I go up? Let me go up. Where does this lead us? Does this lead me to the jail? Oh my God, it does. I'm incredible. How do I... Oh. Oh. Nice. Useful. Thank you, random quest. You good, Wobbin? Huh? You? Where did you come from? Uh, well, my mother, but, like, I don't remember her. It must be nice to be able to come and go as you please. Meanwhile, I'm just in this cell. It isn't all that bad, though. I'm able to see my daughter, Acklet, every day, from a distance, at least. Aww. But I haven't seen Perda at all. It's been a little tough on the old spirit. She once told me that she... Yeah, the, yeah, the, yeah, the clothing store. Shut up. Uh, ma'am, can I get out? Oh, my God. You get to sleep in an actual bed? Well, you know, a rock. Can I... How did you get in there, Magic? That's obviously a jail cell, not a place for visitors. Only prisoners are supposed to be in there, like that Vo who tried to get into town. But you, you're the chief's guest, aren't you? The fact that you got in there on purpose or by accident without me knowing would be embarrassing, so get out of there before anyone sees you. Come on. Nice. But thank you. Wabin, I, that was your chance to get out, but, you know, you wasted your chance. So I guess we could go check out the clothing store. Maybe it might, it might be helpful. And then we could... I guess we're doing quests in Grudo Town. I... Well, we don't need to do anything else. Are you Madison? Oh, you're Makure. Hello, Mr. Vo. I'm happy that we can finally talk. I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to talk to the childs, but, you know. Whatever. I was definitely real scared of talking to you at first, but I did want to talk, I promise. I'm helping out in my Vaba shop. My big sister Kalani taught me a bunch of stuff, so I'm really good at explaining things now, too. Did you know, um... The bomb flowers go boom, and the yellow zappy things are all like bzz, bzz. Oh, and the white ones go crack, and the red ones go boosh, because of all the fire. You're a good kid, Makure. Meet, meet. Oh, hello, um, Isha. Sava. What do you think of my specialty crafted arms? Of this? They're incredible. Uh, it just felt like saying hello. <laughs> Hylian and Vo say the cutest things sometimes. I'm happy to see you too. Oh, great. Um, how much do I need for various things? I need... Hold on, let me do the math. I need 2,400. 3,700. 5,100. 6,300. 7,000. 7,400 dollars. Okay, next time we get 7,400 dollars, I can buy all of that stuff. Where's the clothing stop shop? Can I go inside? I'm looking... Uh, does anyone remember what the name of the guy's wife is? I've already forgotten. I didn't commit it to memory. Oh. Sound like the monsters are... Perda, that's the name. Never mind. Figured it out. Could you move that crate away from the door? Have you guys been barricaded in here for like the weeks in, in the interim between the time I've done this? Oh, of course. Sorry, let me move it now. Easy as... Ugh. I threw out my back. It's all of those kidney stones. Oh my gosh, she genuinely threw out her back. <laughs> nice. What? No, 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 you can't lift... I can't lift that myself. What are we gonna do? Customers won't be able to get in if we can't unblock the door. Can I just... Okay. Uh, ladies, get out of the way. Wow, they build their doors different in Grudo Town. We barricaded the door from the inside so that monsters couldn't get in. But you're out until the back heals, Bird, and there's no way I can move something so... I well, I've already destroyed... Yeah, shut up. Shut up. Alright, we need to find a way underground. So, Perto's shop is this one in the corner. So, we need to find a way underground. Is there a back entrance? Oh, side quest. Side quest. Ah, oh, give it to me. I heard there's a place out in the desert with huge statues that are all facing each other. 
Have any of your customers ever mentioned seeing something like that while they're surfing the dunes? Oh, this is Pokey. I don't remember Pokey. Hard to say, the desert has its share of statues and ruins, and of course the upheaval really changed everything. Do you have any more information to go on? Maybe a map or something? Uh. I did have one, but the wind caught it and it blew off the who knows where. I know for sure that it's in the eastern part of the desert, though. It's like, yeah, the, the wind blew it off into the desert, and this parchment is the same color as the sand, but I can't absolutely track it down to the east. Unless you're talking about the statues. Mm. It helps to know it's in the east, but, well, the desert is really, really big. <gasps> ah, a customer. Can I buy a sand steel? Sorry, I need to get back to work. If you figure out where do you need to go, come back and see me. I'll be happy to rent a sand seal for you for the trip. Can I just... Here, I figured out... I know where it is. Hey you, you look like you're done your fair share of ex I have. Have you ever seen massive ruins with huge statues? Yeah, yeah, I have. I lost my map, so I don't actually know where they are. Does that sound familiar? If you know what I'm talking about, I'd appreciate it if you could take me there on a sleigh seal. Exploration expenses were paid in advance. Ah, uh, but the thing, ah, uh, sure, I'll take you there. In that case, I'll wait for you over at the Eastern Gate. Come find, well, okay. You go sit in the sand steel. I'll be like, I need like an extra 20 minutes to help out Greta, Perda, Perda in the shop, and then, because they're, they're currently, like, barricaded in, and they will die of food dehydration if I, if I don't have, just, I need, like, 20 minutes, Pokey. I'll find them really quick. Maybe I can use this to go down. Okay, so we need to find the Pokey place. We need to go in the other direction. Yeah, <sighs> fine, whatever, it's not like I care about my health. There are easier ways to do things, but this is the fastest. St oh, fine with this. Where I can't even summon Yunobo because you know we're in a town. This is fine. This is fine. Where where are we even going? Why are there so many rocks that I need to blow up? And yes, I've realized there are better ways of doing this, but I don't care. Oh, fairies, right. How many of those do I have left? Should probably be aware of that. I need to be cognizant of my little dudes. I only have two left. Need to go find no oh, more more little fairy dudes. What is the point of even coming over here? Ruins? Why do I care about ruins? What is the point? Why did I bother? Fine, I guess I can use a send to go check out why I bothered. Oh, this is the shop. All right, well, this is what I came for, so I'm glad we figured that out. Client list, check. Products, check. Hmm? Oh, whoa, but the door is blocked. How did you... Never mind. It's our rule not to pry into the business of our customers. You're welcome in our shop, no matter what. How, No matter how you manage to make it inside. Oh. This is the Grudo Secret Club, the only shop in town that sells clothing designed for Vos. Oh, excuse me. Considering Vos aren't allowed in town, I'm sure you can understand why the shop's a secret. Anyway, that's how we run our business. We're not concerned with who you are or what you're doing. As an outcast myself, I appreciate the business. Oh my god, pants! Oh, sand steel and snow boots. Oh, 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 that's that's $2,500. Oh, $2,500, $2,500, $2,500. Do I buy the pants? Buy the pants. Do the... Buy the pants. Buy the pants. Sava Saba. Elsewhere, it might be Sava Sota or Savak, but here it's always Sava Saba. That'll be 30... Yes. Stupid. I needed this money for other things, but, you know, pants. How can I... How can I do anything other than pants? Oh my god, all of my money. Oh. All of my money. How am I supposed to buy house upgrades? Where is the desert hat? That's 650, but that's 1300. Oh. Mm. 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 Well, now we're down to $43. I just spent nearly $3,000 on pants. And you guys don't even have a headdress in stock. Can I... Can I just... Can I just... 
Fine, I have a Master Sword. It's the legendary Master Sword of box breaking. Whatever, I got the store out of the way. We're good. Perda, your husband's in jail. I was not expecting a vote to suddenly appear right before my eyes. It nearly made me jump out of my skin. I should thank you, though. I had a crick in my back, but the shock of your revival seems to have fixed it. <laughs> my husband is a highly invoked, too. Imagine if he'd be the one that's suddenly appearing, but obviously he isn't. Uh, funny, funny story about that, Perda. Since it's customary for Gruda to return to town at a certain age, our daughter and I moved back here. Mm. I warned my husband several times that Vo were not allowed inside the town and were sometimes jailed, but... Well, he insisted on traveling with us all the way here, and I saw him eyeing the town walls when we parted ways. Oh, Wobbin, I wonder where you're up. He's in jail. Mm. Anyway, once you're done shopping, you better get out of town. Before I'm specially allowed. Maybe I'll take a picture of her and... Can I just take a picture for your husband? Just This is purely for your husband's sake. This is not in any way like some kind of creepy ritual for something. This is for your husband. I I am a messenger of love. Hero of Christmas and local Hyrule cr Cupid. That's what Link is. All right, now that that's out of the way, I need to get a picture of Madison. Where? I need a picture of Madison for... Hudson, that's the name. So where is that kid? When you're looking for a kid, check the bar. That's the first place they always go to. Nope, no children at the bar. Maybe they're around here with the hot air balloon. Oh, where is Madison? She's gotta be around here somewhere, right? Oh, pardon me, ma'am, pardon me. Isha, have you seen a small Hylian child? Oh, you're Makure. What are we gonna talk about at Kids Club today? Oh wait, is she in school? Oh yeah, look at you're mad. At, you're the one. Sava, the trend is to keep intro introductions short. Mama taught me that's Mama taught me Sava Sava, but that's how old people say it. Huh? You're the guy who gave me those sun the lions. I am. Sark for that. The sun balloon Papa made me is really popular, so I made friends with everyone in town right away. It's just like Mama and Papa said. They're they're still watching over me, even though we're far apart. I just remember that when I'm feeling sad, I'm really glad I came here. Here, hold on. Picture of Madison. That'll be perfect for Hudson. He'll love that. I should probably talk to the other child. You're Acklet! Oh my god, you're a Wobbin's daughter. I hope the others come soon. I feel like I can hear Mommy's voice from here. It makes me sleepy. Alright, now that all of the temporary... Well, this trip in Grudo Town is complete. Let's go actually fulfill our promise. Pokey. I thought you said the travel expenses were all paid for. Where is the sand seal? Whoa. Quite a wait. Yeah, I'm yeah, I'm here. Yes, yes, yes. So please, could Oh, I have to go get one. All right, fine. Normally it's the person <sighs> fine. Fine. I can be your archaeological sponsor. Can I have a sand sleigh? Frelly, please. Yeah, 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 I'm ready. Oh, good thing I have enough money. Wait, no, I don't. Oh, I need to find $10. Where can I go find $10? This one is worth eight. I need something worth seven. Uh, fine, you may have one apple. One. Yes, just one. Don't you, don't you sass me. And a tomato. I'll give you an apple and a tomato. $50. I will have zero money. But that's fine. Why would I ever need anything more than zero dollar? What are these things for? Can I just take these now? I don't know what they're for. Just throw them all together. I'll just remember where they are. <laughs> no, I won't. I'll forget. I have my money. I sold an apple and a tomato. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Uh, yes, I'll rent one. Sand sleigh. Sleigh seal. Sand slay. <laughs> you slay, sand. Slay, sand. Ah, uh, delicious water. Okay, Pokey. You're not Pokey. Pokey, I got the thing. Let's go. I see you prepared a sand seal. It took me all of my money, so you... You... We... This better work. Pokey, I swear, I will take you to the nearest cave and absolutely ravage you if... You know, my heart may be set on Caliban, but like, you know, this is, I'm pretty sure there are some cultures across history where you had to like kidnap a woman to marry her. So, I mean, like it tracks probably. 
Just don't pay attention to the monsters. Everything, everything will work. Where are we even going? I'm pretty sure we're going to the statues. I don't even know where they are. They're just, they're around here somewhere. I think. By that chasm, perhaps? Where are we? Oh, they're over there. All right, so we just need to turn at some point. We also need a picture of a chew jelly. Oh, a sinkhole, don't crash into the sinkhole. Yeah, 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 I got, I got this. No, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. I understand all of the things. I know where to go and how to do it. Finally, just don't get into an accident. Don't crash the sand seal. I really hope this is the thing that they were talking about because if it's not, I'm a cry. Hope this is what you needed, Pokey, because we're here. Hey, hey, stop here. We're getting close to that time, Pokey, so no need to worry. Maybe when this quest is done, I might consider it. An overall bit of a shorter stream today, but you know, that's what we get when the internet goes out. Hey, look at that. There are statues. They've got swords. Huge statues. They are quite enormous. They're facing each other. Hmm? Hmm? This is another statue, right? It's fallen over, though. Okay, I'm sure this is the place I asked to investigate. Sark, now that I'm here, I can really start my investigation. Oh, and of course, I have to reward you. It better be more than $50. All right, fine. I might have I might have been able to set the bar a bit higher, but, you know, $100 is $100. <laughs> I can tell right away that this place will be worth a really thorough look. I got my work cut out for me. It's already interesting. Rotana said these were supposed to be the ruins of seven heroines, so where are the other two gone? Probably buried under the sand, you know? What do you have to say? Mm -hmm. That was some amazing sand steel staring. Uh, generous. It's exciting just to remember it. I really hope one day I'll be as good as you. Maybe I should try getting a job at the sand steel rental shop when this is done. Well, is there anything for us actually mm -hmm. else over here? Probably not. Did we ever go in this sinkhole? When we were, were we ever over here before? I might've been over here for Korok purposes. I don't think I ever went in the sinkhole. Let me go in the sinkhole. Cause I'm kind of curious. This is, oh, it's, it's a big cave. Oh, it's a big cave. East Grudo Ruins Cave. Well, we've got stuff to do. Let's find this bubble frog. Is that water? No, it's sand. Can we? No, don't, 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 don't get shocked. Oh, my fairy. Oh, you, oh, my stuff is down there. Oh, it floats. There's a cave. All right, there's stuff to explore. Let me let me find the truth about this cave, and we'll find out if I have perfectly aimed aim. Give me that eyeball. Give me that eyeball. Give it to me. I need that eyeball. So where are we going? There's a lake like over there. Um, maybe if I built a raft. Do I care that much? I really don't. Why does jumping cause so much stamina? Oh, stupid lizard, I needed you. I feel like I'm in Skyward Sword at the desert. Just trying to go along, but it doesn't matter. Wait, does my, my, I bought pants for this occasion. Does that help me? It doesn't help me. Well, it's just because the sand is moving doesn't mean it's not helpful. Destroy it, destroy it, destroy it. Oh, Tulip, nice job. Amber, Sapphire, Sapphire, Topaz, all of this stuff, it's mine now. What are you gonna give me? Shield of the Mind's Eye, perhaps? Oh, it's a Grudo Spear. They eat Grudo weapons. Well, I don't care. I don't care. Give me the lizard. Lizard obtained. Where are we going? Oh, more bombs, lovely. Is there something over here for us, perhaps? Oh, it's a statue with a chest. Well, we can open up this chest at the very least. Topaz. It's a topazio. Oh, there's the bubble frog. That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted. Stop moving. 
We've broken our Demon King bow. How wretched. Alright, let's go say hi to Colton. Because this is the cave, so unless we have something else to do, let's go to the cave. Um, yeah, let's go, let's go to, let's go to Colton. Let's go, let's go to my house so I can make it nighttime. Then we'll sleep, go find Colton. And then I'll do shrines until the end of the stream. How about that? Because we still need to do a bunch of shrines, so. The frog feet look like hands. All right, how much, how much, what is the goal, Colton? Foul weather count, foul my mood when I'm on my way to becoming a story. Yeah, 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 gems, how many do you need? Four. All right. If I track down one more in a cave, I can get whatever's next, hopefully. Maybe. Just give me these Gliacorns. Not like I need them, but, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Three Gliacorns. Nice. <gasps> Finally. How many? How many do you want for this? Five. Oh, 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 oh. Shrines or headpiece. Shrines or hat. Shrines or hat. Are there any are there any caves nearby we can go into? Oh, uh, gotta find a cave. Gotta there are two caves over here. There's a cave by this shrine. I know I said I was doing shrines, but I want that hat. There's got to be a bubble gem in here. There's always bubble gems in caves. I'm just too stupid to find the ones that aren't. Like like shut up. I don't care. Oh, I see one off in the distance. Oh, it's stupid. Oh, uh, uh, fine. I, I can deal with you. I can deal with I have a thing I can deal with you with. You're just a dude. Shut up. You think you can beat me? I have a sword of evil sword bane. I'm not even wearing any actual special armor. I'm just... Balls to the wall with my stuff. This sword is massive. I didn't expect to fight a Henox over here. Oh, wait, yes, I did, because I've been in here before. That's why I know what this cave is. Right, I remember. And it said it was defeated, so, you know. <laughs> I'm just an unobservant moron. I'm here for you. Give me that gem. Good. I don't suppose there's anything else around here. I don't care about the Horriblins. Well, I do, but, like... I need their horns, but I don't need it that badly. Okay, so there's another cave over here we can get to. Alright, so if we're in a cave, we're just gonna go up, 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 please, before they hit you. Swim through the rocks, my friend. Swim through the rocks. Okay, so where is the cave? Buttons, work with me. It's over in that direction. Alright, so we need to go over here, and then probably go up a little bit I have to say so let's get into the wind tunnel and we can go up and then where's my cave where's my cave it's probably over here with all that luminous stone yeah there's the cave okay we don't care about that luminous stone I well I just want this oh rocks blocking the way have I already been in here I might have already been in here. Oh, blue thing. I need Yonobo. Oh, it's because... Uh, yeah, I came in here because in the off-stream segment where I hunted big monsters, there was a Talus that I wanted to get, so... Talus. Didn't do anything else, though, so we should still be good. Bubble Frog. Bubble Frog. Bubble Frog. Bubble Frog. Bubble Frog! Look at me. Good. Give me this. Perfect. Now we can get our hat. Give me that last big one. You know, Bo, are you still around? I think that's a gem. Cool. If we're quick enough, we should be able to get back to Colton. I wonder if anything actually comes of giving him all of these bubble gems. Probably not, but maybe. Foul weather can't foul my mood. What is this I sense? Yes, I have gobs of them. Give me this hat. I demand the hat. Hat reminds me of Jai Jairia from Naruto. I don't know who Jairia is. I have not seen Naruto. 
I've seen one episode of Naruto when I was a wee, wee, wee child. I think they, like, crucified Naruto. It was, like, really early on, and they had to, like, not feed him food. And then, like, and then they, like, they fed him food, and they're like, you passed the test. You know friendship or whatever, something like that. It was, like, really early on. Give me my hat. I'm sorry now that I'm by myself. I've got the hat. Headgear acquired in exchange for bubble gems made with prayers to spirits. It protects the wearer, allowing them to lose rupees. Well, I don't have any money. Uh, I've eaten all those bubble gems and I still haven't turned into a Satori. What if I need to eat all the bubble gems? Traveler, I promise this is the last thing I'll ask of you. Would you, prettiest of pleases, collect all the remaining bubble gems? No, it's not right. I don't have a single treasure left to trade. I couldn't, I shouldn't ask such a favor of you. Well, I guess I'll get them. I have no idea how many are left, but I'll find them. Oh, oh it's perfect. It flows in the wind and, and every, this is great. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I will never take, I will never take it off. I, what other clothing do we have that might pair well? I love the frog suit, but this is just way too thematic. I have gone Super Saiyan 3 Ultra Instinct. So where are we going now? Shrines. There are some shrines up in the sky I could always do. Uh, there were some by... Yeah, we'll do these two shrines, I guess. joko -oo -oo Shrine. How many do we actually have? I think we have seven in our inventory. We have... Six. All right, these last two will be pretty good for us getting uh, two more upgrades. I am a hungry boy. You have no idea how much energy I needed to use to flip all of the breakers and then j run back in the house to see what turned off and then what turned back on. Wait, is this just the reward? All right, fine. We can, might end the stream a bit earlier than I would. I want challenges. Why are there so many blessings? Diamond? Diamond? You know what I say about all of your diamonds, Minoru? I never leave with more than I take. I never take more than I leave, so I should still have... Yeah, I still have my 12 diamonds. You may have more diamonds, Minoru, or Raru, whoever. It's like, I, I... I'm good. I don't... I don't... I don't require... I am a generous hero. It's all of the hair. Diamonds is stored in the hair. It's great. It's incredible. I love the style of this hat. It's so good. Although I am curious to see how much rupees different things take because if i was programming this like a logical assumption i imagine would be to just like the more damage you take the more money you, you take but like how much money and does it like completely stop damage curious we can always go check out what that big boy is watch this be another blessing i wouldn't be surprised Load it up, Tears of the Kingdom. Load up the thing. We're really close to 100. Oh, okay, fine. The Nakey Trial. This shrine imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. Short circuit. Stuff with electricity, perhaps? All right, what do I have to work with? Sticks. Well, I can work with sticks. What do we need to do? Stealth? Dun, dun, dun. That's a big metal box? Oh, excuse me. No, I can't manipulate it. Ooh, can I just take these shock fruits? Oh, wow. Chill out. Here, I will... I have no idea what this is actually going to make, but... Oh, I get one shot with that, do I? Well, that's fine. Wow, you guys do no damage to me. Can I have that shield, though, please? I don't need the Construct Horn, but I do need this Soldier Sword. Okay, uh, I'll take that bow, please. Five arrows, not terrible. Shock Fruit, not super helpful. Okay. 
no idea if I need those arrows to be shocky powerful. No, I don't. Oh, I definitely need it against that dude. Well, that was a waste. Oh, you got glory rushed. Ow, ow. Give me that thing. Can I have that? How much? How does this work? Oh, you got erased. Oh, you have no idea what you've unleashed upon yourself. You have no idea how powerful I am. I will get you in a corner and I will just beat you senseless. You cannot get up. This is totally kicking a man while he's down, but do I care? Not a bit. Your equipment will be returned. Why is this called short circuit? I did like no electric damage. I killed like one dude. Oh, the hat. The hat is back. Cool. Oh, I love this hair. I love this hair so much. Flows in the wind. I imagine going to the bathroom, though, would be quite, um... Terrible. Or showering. Imagine how much shampoo Raru had to use. Like, how would you clean that much hair? That would probably be hell on, you know, like, the funds for the shampoo. It's like all of, oh, like, oh my god, and the amount of hair that would just, like, fall out naturally. It's like, you could, imagine how many times Sonya complained about, like, clogging the drain or whatever. It's like, it's like, yeah, I'm, it's like, I am just, like, oh my gosh, she, she'd be struck speechless. That is the power of having long hair, because I have long hair myself, and I'm like, this is not, it's not, it's not even a quarter of the length of that. The struggles we face. I used to have really long hair. It's like, I still have the long hair. It's like, I probably should get it cut, but you know, like, still. Such a pain. All right, I wanna do one more shrine. It's like, we'll do one more shrine. Do one, give me one more shrine. Give me one more shrine that we can do. Come on, there has to be one up here that we haven't done. This one over here, all the way to Hebra in the Ejo O shrine. We'll do one more shrine, one bonus shrine. As long as it's not like a a blessing. If it's a blessing, we're doing another bonus shrine. A bonus bonus shrine, if you will. And it'll be great. It'll be great. Unless, of course, all of the ones I go to are bonus shrines. And I'll be like, oh, so many of them. So many. I don't know where I am, but it doesn't matter. Because I am the hero of really long-haired individuals. They look to me, and they'd be like, wow, it's so luxurious. Do you spend, like, $80 a week on conditioner? I'd be like, yes. Yes, I do. More than defense. Is that a thing of ice? Do I care? Can you, like, put that away, please? I have the master... Put that thing away. Like, stop with that. You wretched, vile creature. Can I, here, don't burn out yet. Can I just move this over here? Perfect. And there it goes. There it goes. Attach, what, to the ice cubes? We don't care about the ice cubes. Are you gonna, what kind of shield is this? It's just a square. The dude has a square shield. Put that down. Stone slab shield. Well, props for creativity, but not gonna help you. Wait, I bet I need a square shield myself. Do I need to just like, do something? Can I just, you ain't by, please? I bet the chest was in that ice cube. All right, fine, hold on. Yeah, 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 I'm on fire, no big deal. Everyone can get set on fire. No, it burned up. All right, that's fine. Is there anything else on fire I can... That's not weapons. Fine, fine. You know what? I don't care. Where are my fruit? Fruit. 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 Good, give me this. Wait, my slab is back 
behind the wall. Can I reach through and get my slab, please? Oh, there are some frames. Good. I can give me my slab back. Return the slab. Return the slab. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, wow. You are weak. Were you going to try and hit me with rockets? What an idiot. Where do we have to go? We have to go up there? I have an idea. To attach it like that. Okay, now all that matters is... How do we s stay on? Uh, how? Wait, I can make a little platform. I just need to rotate this and attach it thusly. That way I can stand on the bow. I can't... Only one way to find out. Man, that totally would have worked. That totally would have worked. Fine, fine, game. I'll play by your rules. I'll play by your rules. Not like I care. It's just I want to have... It's creative. It's creative mode. Whatever. Whatever, game. If you want to play this way, it's fine. It doesn't matter. You want to play, you want to play the non-creative game? Whatever. I'll just attach random rockets to random slabs. It's, it's the cur it's the curse of the slab. It just doesn't work. Things don't work out. And that's the slab's curse. Go. Fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. That's kind of an anticlimactic way to end the stream, but we got the hair, and that's the only thing that matters. Raru, I really approve of your hair. It's luxurious. It's like, I can solve things in six seconds, or I can take ten hours to solve it in a way that I could solve it in, like, a minute if I tried it. It's like, I'll set up a way to solve it in one minute. I'll set up, I'll set up the one-minute solution for an hour when if you just do it properly you do it in 10 seconds and i'll be like that doesn't matter all right so this is the end of the stream and the end of the episode so youtube folks thank you for sitting with us leave a like for the hair if you like the hair leave a like 30 seconds right the outro if you watch for 30 seconds or the entire thing thank you so much for tuning in i'll see you in the next episode where hopefully we won't be freezing later